What's going on everyone, Daniel Rodriguez here, and it's time to do a trailer reaction to Marvel's Luke Cage. Uh, the main trailer just released about 12 hours ago today. It's going to be on Netflix on September 30th. It is 2 minutes and 46 seconds long. Uh, about to watch the trailer, man. Super excited. Uh, a lot of interesting things I've heard about the uh, the trailer and what happened. And, uh, you know, certain an iconic costume or an iconic look. Uh, to Luke Cage, so very, very, very interested to see how that's going to go down. Uh, I love Daredevil, of course. I love Jessica Jones. Netflix and Marvel are just—it's it, a—it was meant to be. It was always meant to be, man. So uh, I love Luke Cage and uh, Jessica Jones. I loved Mike Coulter as uh, Luke Cage. He was a badass. He had a lot of cool scenes. He had awesome chemistry with Jessica Jones. So very interested to see where they're going to take us. Uh, wh what journey am I going to go on? How invested will I get? Uh, so super excited for that. Just got back from seeing Suicide Squad for a third time. Man, uh, you know, I was thinking to myself when I was watching the movie, I was like, ah, so much comic book stuff going on, man. It's like, how crazy is that? You have TV, and then you have Netflix, and then you have the movies, and you have the comic books, and you have the online stuff, and just the community itself is so beautiful, so brilliantly done. So let's get right on to it. I don't have software to actually put the footage in the video, so I will put a link down below to the trailer so you guys can check it out. I know I should have software to actually put footage in the video, also for copyright reasons as well. I know, I understand, but uh, let, let's get right on to it, man. Here we go. Three, two, make sure I have the volume on. One. Can you guess? I'm still not sure what I am. I'm just living my life day to day. You should be out there helping people. You think I ask any of this? I was put in some tank like an exotic fish. Came out with abilities. I just want to be left the hell alone. Well, that would be a waste. Netflix. Was that it? That was the only time he's gonna have a look. The perpetual symbol of hope and prosperity. Too much happens in the shadows. People feel what they can't see. The Arasi. This place is our reputation. Our legacy. Our blood. Business and squeeze them hard. Supposed to be cotton mouth, Everybody wants to be the king. That's cool. Sometimes, if you want justice, you have to get it yourself. Very careful. Hungry arms. Yeah, hungry arms. Give us the money. All out war. I like your tone. No, yeah, fuck Luke Cage. Man. I've got you. That's how you become that superhero, man. The city. He's such a big dude, man. I'd be scared. As a new defender. You might be bulletproof. The Harlemate. Oh, a little bit. So it looks like cops will be involved. It's supposed to represent our hopes and dreams. Just like you have to fight for what's right every single day. Yeah, my heart is full of you. Why don't you just tell us your name? Luke Cage. You always gotta do that, man. Stop. The whole neighborhood is yapping about how two goons got the beat down last night. <laughs> September 30th. I really like the poster. I, I, I want to have that poster of him just like that. That is, I think, my favorite poster out of all of the uh, Netflix shows so far. I just like the way he looks like a badass. He has the bullets in his shirt, smoking off, and man, looks really awesome for that. This is a trailer that I have to see a few times. This is a trailer I'd have to see probably three or four times to really get the gist of it. Uh, I know I missed a lot of things, most likely, in the trailer, but, you know, I kind of get it. 
the storyline's basic, you know, you can understand the story from there, but there are a lot of things that happened within the trailer. Uh, I thought Theo Rossi was going to be the main villain. I'm very kind of disappointed that the other guy's the main villain, but all right. I mean, he looks into, he looks psychotic. He looks cool. Uh, I like the whole King aspect of it and that look and the way that the cinematography always works well with the Netflix shows. Uh, so it looks it looks like Daredevil. It looks like Jessica Jones, that sort of style. I'm very happy with that. Uh, I keep on saying I'm very happy with it because I really am. I want September 30th to come around. I can't wait to binge watch it. It's, it definitely looks like a show to binge. Uh, it was too quick, that little reference of his, you know, tiara or that, that Luke Cage look. It was too quick. Uh, so I'm assuming there'll be more longer that look when uh, we first see the show. But, um, it's interesting. I want to know more about his backstory, why the way he is. And, uh, I love the whole, you're, you know, oh, defending, the, one of the defenders, you know, it, to defend, uh, the first defender and shit like that. So I, I'm very interested to see where that goes on. And we see uh, Rosario Dawson do a cameo, so hopefully she's in the uh, show for more than one episode. And maybe Jessica Jones pops in, maybe, somewhere, I don't know, man, super excited. Looks really awesome, looks really good, can't wait. Remember September 30th, comment down below to me what you guys thought about Luke Cage. Thanks again. Till next time, bye-bye.